The Paray, Wild Men or Wild Donkey, is a very unusual military machine. Paray is not its official name, but rather a nickname. This vehicle is fitted with long-range anti-tank guided missiles. It was developed in Israel in the early 1980s as a force multiplier for units operating main battle tanks. It was adopted by Israeli Defense Forces in 1985. Its main role was to engage enemy tanks with long-range guided missiles. The Paray could engage advancing enemy tanks at extremely long range even before they encounter Israeli tanks. For three decades information on this anti-tank missile carrier, as well as its missiles, was kept in high secrecy. First pictures of this vehicle leaked only in 2013. Information on the Paray was declassified only in 2014 to 2015. This vehicle was withdrawn from service in 2017. However it is still unknown how many of these anti-tank vehicles were built. Essentially it is an anti-tank missile carrier, converted from MAGIC-5, M48A5, main battle tank. In the early 1980s Israel operated a large number of these tanks. Front arc of the hull was fitted with add-on explosive reactive armor. The Paray has a new turret, housing anti-tank missile launcher and other associated targeting systems. Externally it resembles a typical Israeli tank turret and even has a fake gun. Operators are located in the forward part of the turret, while the rear part is used for missiles and other systems. The Paray carries a total of 12 anti-tank missiles. Rear panel of the turret can be dropped down in order to access the missiles. Missiles are reloaded manually by the crew. Empty containers can be replaced with the loaded ones. This anti-tank missile carrier was deliberately made to resemble a typical Israeli main battle tank in order to conceal its true role. It improves survivability on the battlefield, as such vehicle would immediately become a priority target for enemy forces. Also its resemblance to a typical main battle tank allowed Israeli defense forces to keep this vehicle in high secrecy for nearly 30 years. This anti-tank missile carrier fires Tammuz, more commonly known as Spike and LOS, long-range anti-tank guided missiles. It was adopted by Israeli Defense Forces in 1981. However, it was revealed to the public only in 2011. This missile is intended to engage enemy armored vehicles and fortifications at extremely long range. This missile has a range of up to 25 kilometers. Some sources report that early versions of this missile had a range of 8 kilometers. Interestingly typical American, Chinese or Russian anti-tank missile carriers can engage targets at a range of only 4 to 6 kilometers. A single spike NLOS missile weights around 70 kilograms. It has a tandem heat type warhead. However also there are versions of this missile with fragmentation warheads for use against infantry. This missile has electro-optical guidance. It can engage targets that are not in the line of sight. The Spike NLOS has pinpoint accuracy even at long ranges. Before firing, a pack with rockets, as well as mast with optical systems, are raised above the turret. At a range of several kilometers operator uses optical systems of the vehicle to detect and track enemy armor. The Paray had the longest engagement range in this class of military machines. Also it was very well protected for this class of vehicles. In fact the Paray was be one of the most protected anti-tank missile carriers that saw operational service. Secondary armament included two externally mounted 7.62mm machine guns. These were used for self-defense. The MAGIC-5 was powered by General Dynamics EVDS 1790-2D diesel engine, developing 750 horsepower. It is likely that the Paray uses the same engine.